Hello and welcome back to the Daily Show and in today's video we'll be talking about the new cars from Hot Wheels, Majorette and Mini GT but before we start let us say thank you to all these Instagram pages so thank you for the pictures we have here future diecast bros so cow 164 collector she loves cars club hot wheels astor hot wheels hot news ministry of diecast mod majorette australasia just in not official and hobby shopee 2018 yeah so uh, please follow them on Instagram and by the way some of them have also YouTube channels like uh, Ministry of Diecast and Hot Wheels Hot News so kindly follow them yeah, and now let us start off first here uh, we have new cars uh, we're gonna check out these new cars from Majorette and these are out now in the market uh, in some some countries so yes, these are premium WRC cars. So this is the new uh, wave of WRC cars. So these cars have metal body, rubber tire suspension, and yes, they are licensed. So yeah, this is a Citroen here. So it was driven by Breen and Martin. So what's cool about this one here is the packaging. You can see uh, it is... Uh, uh, it has a box too so uh, when you open this one you can store it inside the box so they're following what uh, <clears throat> uh, Johnny Lightning and Tamika are doing with the cars uh, Tamika US release and this one here this is the uh, Ford Fiesta so drivers of this car are Ogler and Ingracia so this one has uh, also the Red Bull right there, which is really neat. This one is the Hyundai uh, i20, uh, driven by Neuville. Uh, mi uh, mixed colors on the rims, pretty good looking though. And the next one, the last but not the least of course, this is the most priced car in the set. And it's really expensive right now. Uh, in online stores so we have here the uh, VW Polo uh, WRC and it, it has also the Red Bull uh, Deco Red Bull livery here so really great cars from Majorette so let's uh, proceed now to what Hot Wheels has in store for us so some uh, clearer pictures of the new cars here we uh, we also featured this one in a couple of videos ago so this is the new Alpine A110 Cup so yeah in blue so it has number 36 on the side and this uh, I don't know what this uh, pattern here is called but yeah blue and orange looks good detailed uh, Headlights and taillights for this car. And here's also a new one. This is a Ford Raptor. So Ford Performance on the side. This is in white and black uh, colorway. And it also has a built tough uh, Ford logo on the side. And I love this set of wheels. Uh, uh, this is always found in the Hot Wheels Ford Raptors. Ford Raptor uh, mainline cars and here's also a new uh, five pack here so check this one out we have a green Ford Raptor not quite sure though uh, if this one is available uh, in singles but yeah please do comment down below and uh, yeah if this is available in singles then next we have here a Jeep Wrangler this one is just outstanding really looks fantastic next here we have a Chevy pickup in red okay so yeah this one the Chevy pickup is my favorite among the five here followed by the Jeep Wrangler and the Ford uh, Raptor and these two uh, fantasy cars here uh, lower uh, part of the box 
so this is again the Hot Wheels Hot Trucks, the new Hot Wheels Hot Trucks coming soon and it's also available now in some parts of the world and here's the Acura NSX uh, from the ID series some clearer pictures of the uh, NSX next car here some more uh, clearer pictures of the Aston Martin Vulcan this is the white one which is uh, also the uh, new one of course the previous one was in green and I hope this time they fixed the uh, front light samples because a lot I've seen a lot of Aston Martin Vulcans with uh, crooked front light samples uh, the uh, front light sample is just a little part of the car but it's uh, crooked so new mystery mystery pack here so check out the cars we so like all other uh, uh, mystery mystery series they have uh, 12 cars so the first one we have the 55 Chevy so the number two 2014 Corvette Stingray third one 2013 SRT Viper number four is the Zotic number five is a twin mill number six the bone shaker Number seven, we have the rocket box. Then we have here the diesel boy. Not really quite familiar with these cars. Then number nine, riveted. Ten, carbonic. Eleven, paradox. And twelve, monoposto. So a lot of fantasy cars. Uh, in this new mystery lineup from Hot Wheels. And yeah, check this one out the antisocial club. Uh, BMW M1 Pro car is already sold out so it uh, sold out really quickly but if you were not able to get the car you can order the uh, hoodie right here <laughs> so here's the uh, BMW M1 Pro car from the anti-social social club yeah it is sold out so really bad uh, for collectors, a lot of hoarders got this one and will and uh, will be reselling it for a premium price. So my tip for you guys, if you can wait, then please do just wait for the hype to uh, to go down a little bit or to go down. And uh, yeah, so you won't be paying so much for this car here. <clears throat> so next up here, some 2020 cars we have here a BMW Vito we'll check out the details details on the front and back which is really neat see the front headlights here it has the BMW logo also and the back here is also detailed the taillights are detailed also it also has the VW logo and also on the plate holder it says HCWLS so Hot Wheels in short and next here we have the uh, uh, gas monkey this is a Corvette ga gas monkey in orange so as always this one really looks good so this uh, has the uh, yellow and a lighter shade of orange for the flames on the side so exhaust here on the side is chrome and the uh, engine too is chrome the bumpers are chrome too yeah, so the bumpers and the uh, exhaust and engine, I think, is separate part from the uh, base because the base is orange. Inter in uh, interiors, chrome too. So next, what do we have here? Oh, the uh, this is the uh, mystery box, uh, mystery series. I mean, bone shaker. And now I really don't like this uh, color colorway or color scheme of uh, this uh, mystery bone shaker here. So I think yeah, this is a beige paint job, an off-white uh, color here. I really don't like that in this car. The engine, the exhaust is black and. 
some black and white checkers here okay nah. all I can say is nah I don't really like this uh, color of the bone shaker so sorry about that sorry for the bone shaker fans and next year okay what do we have a new Batman 5 pack here is available now so check out the cars you can see Riddler here and let's see what will be my favorite here what is my favorite among the five oh this one the uh, of course Batmobile it's really good looking yeah, so check that out out for uh, Batman collectors and yeah this is something new I haven't seen this uh, in the wild in stores <laughs> I haven't seen a two-pack yet but yeah correct me if I'm wrong if uh, Hot Wheels has released a two-pack uh, in the past but yeah this is a new one coming and I'm not quite sure what these cars are I think my guess will be uh, these are Aston Martins but what if I am uh, wrong kindly comment down below what the names of these cars are yeah, so thank you in advance for that and next here we have a collaboration be between Joey Logano and Hot Wheels so uh, they have the custom 2018 Ford Mustang GT and the art on this card just looks amazing so check out that art card here and also it also has the uh, signature of Joey Logano printed on the art so uh, if you don't know Joey Logano broke the record so he in here it says uh, it says attempts to build world's longest hot, hot wheels track and yeah I've seen videos that about uh, this uh, record try and he uh, broke the record for that so here is the one is the one scale of the Mustang and here is the hot wheels version of that pretty, pretty neat and RLC car here I featured this one in the preview uh, in some previous videos ago and this is an RLC Lamborghini again check out the opening doors it looks good here it is again everything in this car looks amazing even the rims it matches well with the car it suits well with the car the interior is tan again suits well with the red paint job and this one here comes with the acrylic uh, case and acrylic base so Hot Wheels has released tons of cars right now with the acrylic case so pretty neat pretty neat uh, job by Hot Wheels next here we have from Mini GT so this is a new one and they call it the uh, uh, HKS black so this is the Honda Civic Type R again in HKS black and this one is only available in right hand drive so great looking car here you can see the HKS logo on the back door so, uh, pretty sleek looking here Don't, it doesn't have opening doors love the rims so black and white always looks good i i really hate it when the car is black and the rims are also black but this time black and white again it looks good and that red honda logo right there for the type r's here's the side of the car and here's the uh, rear of the car so details again uh, on the plate holder it says HKS exhaust tips are uh, painted again great details for the uh, Mini GT on the Civic Type R HKS black some more uh, cars here from Mini GT this is a uh, different scales here this is their Land Rover Defender so check that one out I've got nothing uh, to say for this cars here for these vehicles but 
they are just fantastic look at the details on each cars man so so far uh, for my I mean for the store that I always buy online they haven't uh, set pre-orders for this one yet so uh, I don't know when they will allow pre-orders for this cars here but if they do and if the price is not that uh, too expensive too high I might order order both vehicles here of different scales so let's see let's see what will happen <laughs> yeah so again one of my favorite colors this color here and look at that camel tampo on the uh, door and next here some some more news from Hot Wheels some more new cars from Hot Wheels this is the new three pack so check out the cars here this is the black Honda Civic Type R so among the three this one for me is the best looking maybe because I'm a Honda fanboy <laughs> this one here yeah, I think this is an uh, Integra right it look uh, it looks weird uh, pink and purple I think don't match uh, quite well looks like uh, ice cream colors <laughs> and then we have here the Indy 500 oval in white next some are uh, new three packs so a Porsche here in silver so here's a Mustang this is a uh, an, uh, another recolor and a Corvette here. So what else? What else? Okay, some more clear pictures here of the uh, Bugatti Chiron. This is in Zmap, so this is the Zmap one. <clears throat> and yeah, not much changes. Not much. Not much changes uh, in this car except for the Zmap. They map for Hot Wheels uh, for other uh, manufacturers means raw, so no paint job. Only details here on this part. No, I wish they added uh, details on the headlights for this one, and also the uh, tail lights has no details. Kind of suck. <laughs> I'm really quite over with the uh, Bugatti hype. Next here we have, <coughs> and I know this is just a, uh, this is uh, this uh, image here is just Photoshop, but this is the Tesla Cybertruck. Now, as you have known, a couple of days ago, uh, te uh, Tesla has released the uh, Tesla. I mean, released the Cybertruck. So I've seen uh, videos online. Uh, Elon Musk presenting the cyber truck <clears throat> now they photoshop of course this one here and they said uh, okay this is part of the hot wheels green speed of course because this is an electric car <clears throat> yeah so i'm gonna ask you guys if ever hot wheels makes this one will you will you buy it or not so comment down below uh, what who, uh, what will be your uh, opinion about this car and if uh, will you uh, if, will you buy it or not yeah but for me I'll definitely I'll definitely buy it because I mean, look at that it's cool to be honest a lot of people hate the uh, cyber truck yeah and speaking again of cyber truck here is the uh, real life Tesla cyber truck and again, I'm going to ask you the same question. If you guys, bearing uh, whether you can afford it or not, uh, if you have the opportunity, will you buy the Tesla Cybertruck? Yeah, for me, I live in the US. And yeah, it's quite uh, accessible and easy to own a uh, Tesla right there because it's impossible to own one here in the Philippines 
Yeah, I will definitely buy it because look at look at the feature features of this car. I mean, these car, this uh, Cybertruck has three versions. Let's start with off with that. We have the 250 mile version, the 300 mile version, and the 500 mile range version. And the body can withstand uh, bullets. Uh, high impact and also the uh, the windows too but in the uh, in their presentation uh, some uh, some uh, bloopers here the guy threw threw out the window and the window just mashed <laughs> which is quite which is kind of funny though and yeah speaking of the smash windows I I hope if Hot Wheels ever makes a Tesla Cybertruck, they will add smashed window here. <laughs> that would really make it awesome. And yeah, look at the features of the uh, Cyber Cybertruck. Full self-driving, it has auto park, trailer docking for the for all the uh, for all the ranges. And it goes uh, 0 to 60 in just 2.9 seconds. I mean, I mean, it's a huge, huge vehicle and it goes really fast. And it only costs for the uh, basic uh, from 39,900 pesos to 59,900 pesos. Not, not pesos, I mean dollars. <laughs> Can you imagine that? that? It's really an awesome car. A lot of haters, I mean, a lot of people hate this car because it's just too odd looking. But I believe this will be a big hit and will be a contributor to what's coming uh, in the future for the uh, autom automotive industry. Yeah, so that will be all for today's video and i hope you enjoyed this one and if you did please smash the like button subscribe if you haven't yet and stay tuned for more bye bye guys peace out and enjoy the rest of the day bye bye guys see you soon